Yo, what's up, guys? It's your boy, Steve Gavitina. How y'all doing today? Comment down below. Today is going. Anyways, guys, we're back on another video. And today, I'm going to be with movie. Today, I'm going to be doing something that my friend Josiah couldn't continue on the Network 671. We're doing shoe review, guys. So, we're reviewing the X, the Jordan XXXIs. I'm going to refer to them as that. If you guys know the official Jordan term. Good for you. So anyways, we're going to review the box, and we're going to review the shoes, and we're going to review the add-ons given to the shoes. Let's get started with the box. So the box, on the top, we have the XXXI logo. You know, the X's, and then right there, in the corner, I guess, it's an I. It's in a nice matte black, and if you feel the logo, it feels pretty good. Like a, So this is like more of a matte type, and this is more like a... Actually, this feels more like a matte. This feels like a... I have no idea. I don't know my colors. So, anyways, so... Moving on to the, the corners, we have um, these cool little red... Red and black. I don't know what you call these. I'm going to call them dumbbells. Anyways, and then on the bottom, we have a simple all red. So, box quality is pretty normal, which is not up to my standards because the shoe looks amazing but the box does not go with the shoe as well as I would hope. Opening the box we're gonna look at the top of the case we have the XXX the XXXI logo I think I said that wrong and we have the Nike inside now I'm gonna show you one of the add-ons given to the box and it's gonna come in right about now so here's the add-on we got these cool little um, shoelaces which you can switch off there's black which is on the shoe right now and this is the white you can see here the tip is changed from red to white and this shoe is changing from red to black so it's, it's a really cool concept then as you know the paper inside the box to keep it safe boom this looks legit look at this paper they spent probably like good amount of time we got the xxi logo and we got the jordan yep feels like a normal paper okay moving on so let me just pack that all back in the box now for the moment of truth we're going to unveil the jordan xxxi and a quick message hey so we're back and we're gonna show you shoe so we showed you the box for a 10, 10 out of 10 rating, sorry, I'm getting the shoot again, the box, uh, from the 10 out of 10 rating, I would rate this probably a 5 out of 10, it's a half, because it's a normal box for a really good looking shoe, so, I'm going to show one shoe walk, uh, Jones, can you uh, pass me that, oh, okay, so here we go, this is the shoe, the Jordan X X X I. So let's start off with the front. So if you can see here, we got a metallic red, which really looks smooth with the Nike Zoom on it. The Jordan Black logo, really good. Then we have a solid suede red, which looks pretty well done. We have layers inside, which I've usually been seeing from Jordan shoes, which I love, by the way. They feel so good. And as we go over here, we see stitching. It switches from suede to stitching pretty well, going from red. There's the Nike logo in black, all the way to the tip where it turns to white. Here's the bottom of the shoe. We got the logo right there, and we got this really weird pattern. Still don't know what that means. Hoping I will learn what that means too it feels like it doesn't have any grip but trust me it has really good grip like it feels so smooth like i can smooth my hand out just like that but it has really good grip to it so that's a really good plus it feels really good and these are the shoelaces i was talking about the black ones and how it goes from red to black so it's a really good shoe to have um, I almost forgot to mention the white. So it's contrasting from red and white and black in the inside. 
it looks pretty fire, if I do say so myself. From a 1 out of 10 scaling, I would probably give this an 8.5. It's a really good shoe. Not the perfect shoe, but it's a really good one. I'm probably going to be using this a lot. But, yeah. So this is a good shoe to use if you like playing basketball on street. But I suggest not running too much. Like, if you're going to play on a concrete court, don't use this shoe. This shoe, I've tested it out on concrete. It's, it's, it will work, trust me. But keep on using it. You're going to wear it out which is like most shoes so yeah and so these are the shoes right here they're pretty pretty looking look at that these look amazing Jordan really outdid himself with these these are nice so I'm gonna give you the full angle view so if you guys do want this, um, I will leave a link down below to Foot Locker where you can buy it. Just remember guys, I'm not sponsored by Jordan or anything, so I'm just doing this all for free. But if you guys do want to buy these shoes or different colors of these shoes, or you want to subscribe to the channel, all that will be in the description below. And yeah, maybe someday I can buy, I can have my own merchandise and you guys can buy it from there. So, this is my favorite part where we get to put it back where it belongs right here see here it fits in very very well very very well there you go just shut that there and there so that's it for today's video guys if you do like this video make sure to like and subscribe give a thumbs up YouTube I don't know idea what's going on but a thumbs and a like would be appreciated.